So, it's been like, uh, well, it's October 18th, so it's been like four days since I put this dead grass down. And now I'm going to turn it. And I was already turning it, and I pulled a bunch of these weird-looking grubs out of it, if it's still in here. This guy right here. Some sort of, like, beetle or something. Pretty big ones, too. I've seen ones come out of there, like... Probably for like uh, three inches thick, actually, like huge ones. And then, um, let's see, I've seen a bunch of worms, but uh, oh, wait, there's one right there. But it's, it's bringing around, you know, worms now um, where we didn't have worms over here last year. Um, because of the clay, you know, they couldn't crawl through it. So, and just the soil is just so much softer than it used to be. Um, and you can see all the plant matter inside of it and stuff. So it's going to be really good for the plants and in turn good for us. See that? So much clay, it was making clay pots. <laughs> Anyways, October 18th, my mommy's birthday making an update so god bless you all have a great day and uh, coolness I remember when I told you guys I was pulling them out of here that were big ones <laughs> look at the size of that guy that is so gross it is but it's so good here no. you want to eat it no <laughs> it's all bloody would you cut his head off it's not bloody it's that red stuff that's just markings so we'll throw him back in the garden because I think he, he eats waste. So. I thought they were bad for your garden. No. There's nothing in here to be bad about. Anyway, God bless. And voila. All stirred in except for this spot. I planted two zucchini plants um, that we grew over there. And I just want to see if the seeds are going to take. But I stirred in all that organic matter and found a lot of those beetles those little or those big grubs and uh, it's cool saw a lot of tunnels through there which tells me they do the exact same thing as uh, night crawlers so anyways get your gardens ready for spring now you know you work hard during the winter you won't starve during spring or you won't be begging during spring. I think that's in the Bible. So, anyway, see ya.